What it do, YouTube? Is your boy Little Rock, and we're back with another video. I said we're back with another video. All right, this is the video that we're going to look at right now. We saw the part one on my video. If the guys y'all seen that, y'all already know what it is. If y'all didn't see it, go back to that video and then come to this video. This is the part two video. We are here watching Jack TV, and we're gonna see what's going on. There's the more update of that video. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends and family. And yo, the reason why I don't do the intro is so we could keep going straight to the videos. Y'all don't want to see that. So we're going ahead and straight to the videos. That's the reason why I don't even post them no more. All right. Uh, enough talking. Let's get to the video. Welcome back to another episode on Jack TV. I know you guys have been waiting on this update with the world of a dude. But before we get started, here's a quick recap to refresh you guys' memory on how we got here. I found my mom. Uh, he had to buy that girl. So I pulled up to Malika's apartment. He sat in his apartment for hours. Then he finally came out of his apartment and he started to <laughs> That's just the last episode that we saw on my first episode on my channel. That's the first video. This one we're gonna be looking at right now is gonna continue to the second video. Whoa. Wow. Mm. Mm. Bye. That's what he said. He wild out. Mm. No, nope, can't. Yep. Mm. Sorry about the punching in your mouth, yo. Sorry, if it's in your ear, I'm sorry. So you guys, that episode was a lot. Thank you to everybody who reached out to me concerned about my safety. I just want to let you guys know I really appreciate that. And I did go ahead and I hired my own security. So you guys, last thing I want to do. Y'all ain't hired me? Oh, man. Right. What y'all think she's gonna do? She gonna get it back or she won't?
Wow. I hate females like that, yo. How you say you don't got his stuff? You said he had his stuff. No, she ignorant still, bro. Nah, man. Yep. Mm -hmm. Now she says she doesn't have it. Mm. Guys, I have no choice but to call the cops, and I really do not want to do that because we can't just handle this. Like, For real. Well, first and foremost, I did YouTube. I got a network called Jack TV. Uh, somebody I did YouTube. And basically, people hired me to see if they should let you out of the receiving room. He came over here, and not like seriously. <laughs> they laughing, yeah. I'm going to explain the story. One of the artists couldn't help but start laughing, you guys. The situation is so bad, and like, he couldn't even take it serious. We came over here, and her daughter was the victim in the, in the home case, and we caught her cheating with her daughter's boyfriend. Her daughter is the one who let us in the house or whatever. Cool. So we got all the footage. We had left out. I, I left my phone, and I dropped it, because it was like a little altercation between her and her daughter, and I had the camera in my hand, and I dropped my phone. So I noticed I dropped my phone. I came the other day, and I told her I dropped my phone. She said, you're not getting your phone back unless you give me the footage. And you're not getting it back unless you get the camera. <clears throat> I was like, I'm mm. gonna put it for one, it's not my footage, and the cold footage. So, whatever she wants to do with the footage, and that's what she's gonna do with the footage. So, I'm just, I told her I was gonna come over. All I wanted was my phone. I'm not gonna do it. I was just like, uh, man, Yes. Right here. So I left my phone. I know. And you're not getting it back. She at first said that my phone was here, and then now she's saying it's not. Yeah, I, I hate that it had to get to this point, but I just try to be civilized. Mm. So, mm. So, buddy. So the officers went over there and basically took the mom's side of the story. Mm. They went over here and basically told me that they could not make the mom give me my phone back because she basically was over there lying saying that she did not have it. Man. Look, she said she ain't had the phone, and look, she got the phone. He got the phone. Cop was like, dang. Voila, yo. Exactly. Females, man. <laughs> I'll say the same thing, yo. <laughs> yo, fire him and hire me, yo. That is crazy. Yo. That is crazy. That's a crazy update, yo. Yo, Jack. I don't know why she's playing like she didn't want to give you a phone on that. She had the phone and she fold up and hand you the phone. Like, you know, she's wrong. Just because she lied, the cops could have just did something about that on her part. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, they was not trying to make it a big issue and accomplish. So they was like, you know what? Let me just give up the phone and give it to him so it could leave me alone and not bother me again. But, yo, you still exposed, but you're lucky you didn't put your face out there. But still, like, that is dead wrong right there. Nobody should be doing that type of stuff. That shit is messy, yo. Very, very messy. And that could have come out from a different way or a different route. You know what I'm saying? But glad it didn't get too crazy like it was supposed to be. But that's how drama is. Like, people like that, you can't trust, man. You can't trust like your friends, family, and, and other people 
around your spouse or your friends and stuff like that. It's some people are like that, you know, and they just they know they're wrong, but they do it anyway. And that's that's when things backfire. It goes back to them when whatever you do, that's why I preach to people like I see this all the time. Whatever you do to somebody, that junk will come back to you in ten folds for real. That's why I never do anything right now. I don't even do anything. I just relax, chill, focus on me, my family, do these videos, music. That's it. I keep myself busy because I don't like to be around people all the time. You know what I'm saying? Because things like that, that's the reason why I stay away. And yeah, that's just me. I don't know everybody else. I'm just, I'm not too much a social person because I've done it so many times. I don't want to do it no more. So it's just like, I just want to be by myself, you know, and just relax with a few friends, a few coworkers. You know what I mean? And that's it, man. Like, I'm telling you, man, God see everything, yo. God see everything. So whatever you do, until judgment comes, that's on you. Because you know you shouldn't do what you did. So she's messy. And the boyfriend, too, he's messy, too. And I understand how he be like, yo, I don't want to be with her. You don't do much. Well, your mother do much. Yeah, because she got her own job. She do what she had to do, and that's it, you know? And that shouldn't happen, yo. That, yo, the mom is trifling for that. And the boyfriend, trifling. But I hope she get over that and she finds somebody better for her and she could be happy again. But it seems like to her, she going to keep thinking, yo, guys ain't, you know? And she's going to do her. And that's it. And I don't blame her. I don't blame her. So... Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and we got another video coming on the way. Peace.